hello collective welcome back to the com <laughs> welcome back to the collective <laughs> welcome back to the ascended divination priestess channel you are greatly appreciated as always for supporting my dreams because every time you come here to watch you like you share you are supporting a dream okay thank you so much for all of your support uh i return to source i return to sender all negative energies and intent immediately and permanently i call in only the purest of white light and pray that you stay only in the highest of vibrational energies whatever the enemy has stolen from you it is returned to you all evil and negative plans of the enemies against you are dismantled and being dismantled as we speak I am sending you all lots of love, joy, peace, and happiness. Many, many blessings to you and your families, as always. Okay. Judgment is final. Let's go ahead. So you have someone out here that may be having some type of new beginning. The truth is being exposed. There may be someone coming towards you to confess something, tell you the truth. Real quickly, I've been picking up on her energy. It's like there's someone that wants to go to someone's house. Um, it's like they want to come to your house. This is like someone that's a thief. Someone wants to come to your house to make you feel uncomfortable, give you a piece of their mind, try to take something from you, try to set you up, do you something, may even be paying someone to come to your house, your apartment, your condo. So be very cautious. I'm not saying be out here scared to live life, but just stay alert, be vigilant, because it's a nutcase out here uh, trying to come to someone's house unannounced just to surprise you. For one side, it's a woman that wants to go to a man's house that's shutting her house out that does not want to have any type of communications with her because he found out a woman is very karmic, very toxic, low vibrational, very deceitful, and the relationship they've been in is very, very chaotic, uh, something that's very unhealthy, right? Uh, and he has foresight now uh, of everything she's been doing behind the scenes, possibly plotting to take him out and someone else out. She may have even tried to steal from this masculine, has been trying to defeat this man, cause him a lot of burdens and things like that because this is not someone that cares about I love this is someone that just cares about money so she's been trying to deceive him or de uh, destroy him from behind the scenes possibly take something from him on your side is the feminine energy there is possibly someone that was hired to come and do you something um and this person has been trying to find a creative way to get into your energy maybe uh they're waiting when you least expect it when you have your guards down uh they're gonna come in uh, real quickly. Yeah, they're going to try to come in real quickly and do you something maybe when you're asleep or something like that. So just stay vigilant. You're being watched over. You're being protected. You may even have law enforcement watching you and you don't know that. Uh, so we're not telling you to be out here living in fear. We're just saying be alert, be vigilant, keep praying and stay in positive energy and all of that. Um, but there is, is a truth being exposed about some type of either inheritance or there's a woman of high honor in a a community or someone that wants to be seen as high honor there's some type of uh, truth being shown about her you on the other hand you the actual person because whoever i'm picking up on in that community who i've been picking up on in that community is not really someone of high honor this is someone that relies i think on like a third party or second party for their high honor as far as their resources their bag they're getting it from someone else so if they lose their connection with someone then that means they lose their a bougie, a wee wee lifestyle. They're not able to be out here, you know, spassing out on people, you know, putting people in their place because they're wearing the latest Dior or the, they're driving the latest car. They want everybody to know that they have money, but the money they have is coming from what? A king of wands, possibly. And he's more than likely trying to get away from her. Um, So she's afraid of this man uh, leaving her because if he leaves, then she's going to have to start all over. Maybe find herself a new sugar daddy. Maybe actually have to work and she doesn't want to have to work something of that nature so someone is not really of high honor this is just someone that pretends to be and relies you know those women that don't know their place the one that act like they're better than everybody else but they have to rely on men for handouts and things like that and i'm not saying that with ego i'm just saying you know you gotta humble yourself you can't be out here putting sisters down and actually putting the work to get to where they are and you want to be out here feeling good about yourself because you got to rely and go beg for money. Uh-uh, that ain't how it works. Okay, and I'm not saying that to hurt people's feelings, but don't be out here hitting on women or tearing down women that actually put in the work to get what it is they want and need in life, whereas you got to go and 
<clears throat> okay, never mind. Anyways, so there's some type of truth coming out about this woman, um, a couple. It's like everybody, the truth is coming out. Something is being brought to an end. All of these people could be planning something, plotting something to do you, to take you out. Um, but the truth is coming out when it comes to also an uh, inheritance, who it belongs to. Who put in the work to really have this new beginning? Who has the true character? This is the person everybody has been plotting on. There's some type of communication that's supposed to be taking place. Maybe someone tried to send you some type of communication. Maybe the court system tried to send you some type of communication and there was some type of interference. Someone has been paying behind the scenes. They've made some type of connection like they've made a lot of connection in the court system in the communities and things like that to make sure that either some type of letter does not make it to you or someone does not receive some type of letter and it's going to backfire because someone is going to end up having to go to the penitentiary because whatever it is that you have been committing yourself to ma'am sir you're definitely going to be doing time because it is illegal Something you are blocking is federal. It's no longer like just, you know, me and my karmic friends get together and we do, you know, petty stuff. No, this has gotten federal and you are going to be doing a uh, time. Um, and just so you know, okay, I'm telling you, <laughs> you are about to be out here going through the hard knock life. It ain't getting no better. And you got legal issues coming in. So whatever actions you're planning on taking, baby, it's about to end this chapter for you. Good and done. Um... What was I going to say? Anyway, it'll come back. Lord have mercy. I've had a busy day. <laughs> don't count down. Don't hold it against me, folks. Don't hold it against me. Don't hold it against me. I'm human. It'll come back. Someone, maybe someone's doing some type of memory spell. Or oh, it's just me doing to a little, doing a little bit too much. Too much. Oh Lord, it's not a source came out in the reverse again. It came out in the reverse in the other reading so there are people out here hoping the community the comic couple the woman of high honor you know the one that gotta rely on other people the one with the false wealth um they are planning on take they were planning on taking some type of action or they're plotting on taking some type of action against either a feminine energy or a masculine um they may be paying someone to do this on their behalf and they want something to be done to you unexpectedly they, they, they want it to look natural all right because you know hanging out here in limbo on a tree or something is very natural looking you know you just got up there you tie the rope uh, uh, up there and you just you know tie your hand behind your back tie your feet together and then you you know, ditch yourself in at the end, put the rope around your neck and you just, that's very natural looking. Um, anyway, so this is what they're plotting. They want someone to come and take you out because someone is very malicious. I said malicious. The death came out. Someone is very malicious. Someone is very wicked. Someone is just very greedy, cold hearted, soulless, an empty vessel moving about the face of the earth. They don't even care about the people they're working with. They all think they're partners in crime. It ain't no partnerships, friendships, or nothing. This is all about money. There's a community of people that are like-minded and it's very dangerous for these kind of people to be in the same camp because they all don't give two Fs about other people. All they care about is their security. And just all you, just so you all know, your time is coming. This is what you all are about to be going through. And do not be out here crying nothing, okay? Because two people will still be coming together, whether this is in business, finance, relationship, whatever, file, romance, they'll still be coming together. But you all will be going through some type of karma when it is happening. Do not be out here crying. You know how committed and how joyful you all are and how determined you are to take somebody out. Be just as determined when you are going through that poverty that I like okay when you are having a hard time getting getting a dollar to give yourself a, 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 a some candy bar just to eat for the day make sure you stay still have that smile on your face because something is about to get i'm telling you something is about to get real nasty real bad for a community a friend a group a friend group friend group okay friendship it's about to be problems if something is, if you guys are going through something right now in that community, this is just a start. It's what I'm being told to tell you all. And it's the same thing that came in the reading previously. They said this is just the beginning. This karma that's playing out, the truth being exposed, clarity being out here for the rest of the people in the community that were not aware of what it is you all were doing because you all have been collaborating. The truth is out about everything or it's coming out. And there's nothing you all can do to stop it. 
uh, you may be being watched by a police officer as the law is watching you all. And they're going to make sure you all sink deep, 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 deep. You're going to be so far down into the ground, you won't be able to get back out, okay? Because whatever tower is coming for you all, it's not something you'll be able to recover from again. Um, because this is the only way something is going to be balanced out is what the universe is saying. This, uh, this is what spirit is saying. That in order for you all to learn your lesson um, and learn not to do this again, you got to go through some type of horrendous experience. So the whole group... The whole community is about to be ending a chapter, um, and you all are not going to end this chapter the way you think <laughs> it's going to. It's not going to be happy. There's something going on behind the scenes where it's like a whole community of people. Like something, something, baby, something is not going accordingly. This is the end of these people causing conflict for someone or uh, uh, two people. They've been causing a lot of manipulations behind the scenes, a lot of just all kinds of lies, deceit. Trying to keep someone in the past. Uh, if a man want to move on with his life, start over. They're trying to stop him. If a woman want to move on with her life and start over, they're trying to stop her. They don't want two people connecting. They don't want people having happiness. I don't know what the heck this is. It has something to do with some type of money, some type of insurance, uh, some type of security. A woman feels that her being with a man is her security. That's how she secures her bag. So she does not want this man connecting with someone else or a specific energy because she knows if he connects with that specific energy, it's the end for her. And he's not going to be out here having options. Because whoever this woman is that I picked up on, she does not mind this man having options. As long as he gives her that money. What was that? Money. There's something weird going on. Maybe she's not getting the money anymore. But it's the end of illusions. It's the end of someone being isolated. Maybe a man has been being isolated. A woman has been being isolated. It's the end of all of this. And it has these people... Just worry with a lot of anxiety because they're not able to manipulate anyone anymore. Maybe there's someone in their camp now that sees the truth. Oh, yeah, there's someone in the camp now that sees the truth. And maybe they're balancing something out. We don't know who this person is. Even if I know, I'm not going to tell you. Because these kind of people, when they find out who's doing what, if, it's, if someone is doing the right thing, they will, you know, go after them, try to attack them. But there's something in the court case that's going to be balanced out. The truth is going to be exposed about a collaboration that has been taking place behind the scenes uh, to block someone's uh, forward movement, block someone's resources, all of the... Uh, um, Scam, the dark magic, the thief, thievery, the, the thievery, there's some type of word. Uh, oh, what is the word that I want to use? Corruption. Thank you. There's some type of corruption in an institution. I said institution split the deck and it went right on the higher fin. There is some type of uh, corruption that's going to be exposed that's been taking place within an institution for a long time. This is an institution that is into some type of witchcraft, voodoo, ritual. They are very tight-knit. There's a specific sector within the organization, within the institution. It's like a clique of people that have been tormenting this whole community for years and all of that is about to be put to an end all of the members of that clique tribe cult clothing whatever you all want to call yourself it's the end of the role for you all it's about to be poverty a woman of high honor and a king of pentacles may end up working together and i'm talking about the actual woman of high honor not you that's been out here pretending to be a woman of high honor because you need this man you rely on this man for your finances and then you get out here and say you're bad and bougie girl stop it um but something is absolutely coming to an end being exposed um the, the truth is also out about a king of pentacles this could be a different one uh and how he's very greedy very karmic someone's very vain this is like a narcissist this is someone that's very entitled has been very determined to block two people from connecting or to just block a feminine energy maybe he's intimidated by you or something like that and then you have another king of pentacles that's out here maybe he's been Oh, Laura, working with a queen of pentacles behind the scenes that's very karmic, very dark as well. It's like birds of a feather flock together. Um, but at the end of the day, the two people, the two light workers, divine beings that are meant to come together will come together. Whoever was trying to force their way with this man, it's like they were trying to force some type of connection, some type of family dynamic. It's like 
uh, like a friendship or relationship, trying to get this man to give to them or something like that. It's not happening. He's not giving to her anymore because I think he feels like he's he has seen his match. He has met his match. So he may be doing the necessary or taking the necessary steps to uh, make sure that he connects with who it is that he wants to connect with in divine timing. He may want to maybe present a contract to a queen of pentacles. And there are people out here hoping that you don't receive your contract. You don't receive this information. You don't receive this letter. But you are going to receive this letter when it is time for you to receive it because when it's happening it's going to be by divine intervention with this ace of source out here the universe is going to be making sure that you get what is yours they said they don't care what they got to do to make sure you get what's yours because you've done the work baby you, you, you're out here in a three of pentacles energy meaning you are skilled skilled and this man may admire your work your work has you in a nine of pentacles energy and he wants to put you in that ten of pentacles possibly ten of cups energy and i don't mean that you two are going to be together as lovers you may end up being that um, because the ten of cups can have to do with that but i'm what i'm more so seeing right now is that this man may want to work with you support you invest in your business you could be someone that's in the public eye he could be someone that's in the public eye but someone wants to share with you but there are people out here that are 18 you know it's always got to be a hater around the corner but you know that like cat williams said you if you don't have any haters you ain't doing the right thing you need to collect become a collector of hate ties you know how people uh collect memorabiliums and what the heck did i just say memorabiliums excuse me uh you know how people collect you know car sports cards uh people collect all different types of things um be out here a hater collection because you know honey if you don't have a hater you ain't doing the right thing you ain't doing nothing good in life um if you ain't elevating baby you ain't gonna have haters you got to elevate to have the haters but then again you can you, anybody can be a hater you can have you know a patch of hair and somebody that don't got no hair is gonna hit on you, hit on you for having that patch of hair but at the end of the day that is your patch of hair girl Show that patch of hair some love. No. Like me here with my no edges on the right side. But baby, I still show my right side some edge. Not that edge side, you know. I still show some love. You know, I still be rubber dub dub dubbing that side. It is what it is. Okay. So anyway, you know, my edges, you know, what what they wild and what did they say on wild and now? She um she made it to the cookout, but her edges didn't make it. Yeah, my edges ain't never made it to the cookout. It's been, I don't know how long now. That's, that, okay, that's enough about me and my edges that ain't there. And that ain't there, okay? Let's go ahead and get back into this read. You got people hoping out here that you don't receive your offer. This person does not come in to give you anything. They don't, they want to separate. They want to cause you some type of burdens. They don't want you manifesting. They don't want you, you know, they want you to digress. Like, instead of being in this queen of pentacles energy with the family, joyful and things like that, happy family, they want you out here still struggling, sick, mentally ill, all kinds of stuff, uh, not able to move forward. But it looks like this is what's happening to your enemies. The universe has a very uh, interesting way of settling the scores. Oftentimes, when you are co-creating with the universe, you never really got to lift a finger to do anything. All you got to do is ask them to move on your behalf. Ancestors, angel of ours, angel of mine, please move on our behalf. Avenge us accordingly and bring balance into these situations because we bring balance into these situations because we are ready to get on with our lives and fulfill our purpose, get on with our destiny. But these Karmics won't leave us be, won't leave us alone. Leave us be, won't you? You want to argue. We don't want to argue with you. We got time. We got better things to do with our time. Okay? Queen of Wands in a community, baby. I know you're burdened out here because a man moving on with his life. Your money is about to come to an end. You can't pretend anymore to be something you are not. You never been that either. Um, but you're about to go through some type of ending. I know you're very determined to block someone, trap someone, defeat someone because you want to be seen as the genuine one. You're not. And they know your community, the person you're with or trying to deceive, they know. So, you know, it's one thing to have a secret. But if everybody knows the secret, girl, it ain't a secret no more. Give it up. But this woman is crazy. She said she is going to keep doing something. And baby, you're going to keep doing it. But where you're about to head uh, to is in the court in a court case. And you're going to have to pay it out. A whole lot of money. 
and the court system, and you're about to be stuck in a situation. Maybe you, it's going to be a nightmare for you. And the court system, they're going to tell you, well, we don't care what it is um, that you're going through. You're going to have to pay this person their money. Okay? So, you keep on going on trying to block someone, have them out in the cold. This is what's about to happen to you. You're about to be put out of a home, losing everything. I know some of you have people that watch terror readers to report to you because you don't want us to pick up on your nasty energies so you have a third second party watching us to report to you but baby we still know who it is that's watching us to report to you we know we know uh-huh we know because they come with the same energy as you worry toxic karma because birds of a feather flock together so we always know when they're watching because when they come to watch they come with that same energy you have say oh maria sent elizabeth to come and watch elizabeth be sure to tell maria she's gonna be put out of her home okay she's gonna have to let it go that little persona of hers that she's been keeping up to keep a man she's gonna have to let it go we don't got time today tomorrow or any other day the ancestors don't have time they are done 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 okay je fini is what they say to fini je fini i'm done you're done this is it okay okay i'm telling you to fini to fini to fini to fini oh <laughs> Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Okay, too finny. Um, meaning, baby, ain't no more uh, uh toxicity. You ain't about to be out here lying and stuff because you're jealous of someone. No more illusions. This is the end of the road for you. You about to be way down and burning because everybody's about to know the truth. You can live in fear all you want because people are about to find out all they know. You've been out here manipulating and the ancestors said they got time today, tomorrow, any other day to keep exposing you in someone's new beginning, baby. <laughs> they said, oh, we're going to make sure, make sure this person here received that offer and gets that ten of pentacles. They don't care what it is you're out here doing. You're just making things for your worse for yourself you may not know it now may not see it now but keep taking action and moving forward to keep causing blockages you're about to be out here looking so dumb 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 dumb, 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 dumb. we can't help you okay you can take a water to the horse you can take a horse to the water look 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 you're trying to be don't be trying to confuse me you trying to t girl stop it you can take a horse to the water but you can't make the horse drink the water right folks okay elizabeth and maria are about to learn that lesson maria elizabeth if they took you to the river they already did a lot of work by taking you to the river drink the water okay drink the water water is good for you water is good for you look at you you still don't want to drink the water you say, um, no, I don't, I don't drink water. It's for poor people. Really, Maria? Really, Elizabeth? Really? That's what, that's how you feel? That's how you feel? Source said, oh, okay. You mean that good, good that I gave you? You say that's for what? Poor people? Okay, okay. Okay. You mean I, I, I don't give you all that water supply? It's just right there. And you're acting like you don't see it, but you're going to get yourself some soda. You're going to get some soda, right? That ain't doing nothing for your cells on a cellular level. Right, Maria and Elizabeth? Okay. So it says, since you don't see the value in what it is that I've given you, that's okay. <laughs> we got somebody out here that, saw us, that sees it, that saw us it, that sees it, okay? This is why you're going through conflict, baby. Because guess what, Maria, Elizabeth? Guess what? Guess what? Guess what? Uh-huh. You know those two people you've been trying to block from meeting for like ever? <laughs> At this point, the ancestors, they're just uh, done with the situation. They're like, you know what? We're going to play Russian roulette every day. Tic tac toe, any mini money, more, whatever they want to do. They're going to play it with you all every day. Because you know what? Guess what? Guess what? Guess what? It's still happening. And they're putting the end to the past to have wish fulfillment. Mm. And is that like a girl? Girl, 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 you gotta have an emperor out here not see the, the person he likes is beautiful. Girl, he sees that woman is beautiful. He said, mm, she is. He don't even want to let the rest of the sentences out. Girl, that's how it is. And it's bothering you. She said, no, I'm more beautiful. He said, I don't give to it. <laughs> she said, I'm pretty too. <laughs> He's looking at her like, sure. <laughs> Yeah, you are. You are. Okay. What I got to do with anything? What does I got to do with a price of tea in China? You don't fulfill my 
sneeze <laughs> any other way but the spread <laughs> look at me going off again let me stop let me stop they said to continue no they didn't they said go go all out that's what i just heard go all out i'm gonna go all out on you girl sit down somewhere with your raggedy behind out here gotta pretend to be up in the upright for some money go get a job go get a job a J-O-B. Don't be out here like that girl in that Medea movie to telling Byron, if I gotta get a J-A-B, you ain't getting none. Girl, it ain't a freaking J-A-B. It's a J-O-B. Don't tell me you're one of those illiterate but out here pretending to be intellectual. Girl, you just gotta go read the books. Do the work. You'll be intellectual. Tower. Your mentor is not where it's supposed to be. People didn't know that. They're about to find out you don't know nothing. Nothing, nothing. It's the king of swords, baby. You about to go through a tower. You about to lose a whole religion, my ship. You may have misjudged someone because of what people told you, and it led to you taking some type of action against them. And now you're about to be out here in the cold because this is swords balancing something out because you took something or tried to take something from someone that didn't do nothing to you all based off of an illusion. You've been out here invading someone's privacy. You may even want to come towards the Queen of Cups, go towards the Queen of Cups, wherever you're going wherever direction north south east west you're trying to get into someone's energy to cause them illusions and have them in their mind maybe that man that woman whoever it is you're going to they know you they already know the truth okay they know you're trying to stop them from having a new beginning you ain't coming in with the whole truth nothing but the truth so up you guys Listen, you're going towards a high priestess, man or woman. And them knowing the truth has you trapped. Have you, ooh, you stuck, stuck. Baby, you're stuck. Stuck, stuck. You've been out here trying to block two people from coming together. It's a high priestess that's going through it as well. She's been paid to cause a lot of illusions. She's doing the conflict magic because this is all they know how to do is conflict magic. Challenge them, you know, challenge these people to heal. They can't do it. Simple magic like that, they can't do it. But the conflict magic, oh yeah, they said they got that down. Except the conflict magic is not helping, it's not working no more. <clears throat> so I don't even know why they keep doing it. Is there like a delusional magic too that you all put on yourself so that you don't see the truth? I need somebody to let me know from the karmic community. It's like you're doing all those rituals. Do you do some type of delusional or illusional magic on your service that I will not see the truth that this ritual, these rituals are not working and will never work? I'm going to keep going forward because I am the most powerful high priestess in the world. Or, baby girl, is there a different reason why you're doing what it is you're doing, girl? Let me find out you out here playing chess. Because... <laughs> Let me find out you're out here playing chess. You play chess, girl? You play chess? Or oh, this will be a man. You play chess, sir? You play chess? Because high priestesses, we high priestesses, we got to know how to play chess. We got to know. That's so why we be sitting there just waiting for somebody to, to bust the move so we can say checkmate and checkmate. But they never know that we've already done the checkmate, but they keep going. You say you, you still don't know yet that it's been checkmate a whole long time ago and you still want to keep going? Okay. Okay. Bye. <laughs> okay, folks. Let me hurry up and find out what this Eight of Pentacles. Oh, listen. <laughs> Thank you. They're trying to, trying to hold on to your work. They said, they said uh -uh, his, whatever he's doing, whatever she's doing. Uh-uh. It's not of the light. It's of the dark. They're trying to stay committed to toxicity. They said they want someone to stay in toxicity. They don't want the truth coming out. They want to hide the truth. They're going to keep telling lies to cover the truth. But baby, you see, we started out with the truth. Baby, the truth will always overpower a lie. If you can tell a thousand lies and it just takes one truth to this mental all of those lies illusions deceptions and everything so everything you see how we started out here with the truth one what's this 15 at the end baby that, that lie don't stand no chance 
Someone is being seen as what disingenuous, very jealous, very toxic. Um, maybe you were presenting yourself to be someone that's wise and all known, someone that's you know committed to learning and you know very genuine, articulate, and you know very eccentric. You ain't eccentric, girl. I didn't just stop it. <laughs> anyway, uh, but the truth will always overpower a lie. If you didn't know that, now you know it. Okay, people are starting to listen to their intuitions. People are seeing you for the narcissist that you are they know the truth but how you've been out here paying for love you said i gotta make sure he does not leave me i gotta make sure people believe that i am the one that's gifted i'm the one that created this i'm the innovator i gotta keep it that's what i mean by paying for love because you're paying people to support you your real g's don't pay for nothing real g's move in silence okay we move in silence we don't got to pay for nothing, you know, because when people come around us, our energy just tell it, tell it, just be telling on itself. Any, even someone try to tell us that we got to do something sneaky, we just look at you like, mm -hmm. no, I don't got to do all that. <laughs> I don't got to do all that. I don't gotta, this is not my first rodeo here. I don't got to do all that. Okay. So you got to be out here paying for love, paying for friendships, connections. Paying for partnerships. Maybe these light workers don't got to do that. Because the universe is always... They collaborate with the universe. These light workers, maybe they collaborate with the universe. The universe fix and takes care of the situations behind the scenes. That's why you all can be in a community and be real comfortable. And I think I mentioned this before. You can be in a community and feel real comfortable. Just to causing deception, causing havoc in people's lives being as low vibrational and corrupt as possible and the whole time you're there just telling everybody what it is you're doing feeling comfortable just showing off how toxic you are how you are the best at being very wicked and malicious and conniving and manipulative and toxic as heck whole time you don't know you're talking to a police officer and he's just watching you like oh my gosh when is this assignment gonna be over or she's just watching you like god dang it when is this assignment gonna be oh i'm so sick of these people you never know you never know maria you'll never know billy you could be talking to a police officer you don't know they're on duty and they're about to fix it mr officer sir Miss Officer Ma'am, please fix the situation. Oh, I told you, please fix the situation. The universe says it's time to fix the situation. Okay? Make that decision. Final decision. And weigh these mother suckers down. You know what it is. You know what it is. Yeah, I, I'm telling you, you already know what it is out here. It is time. It is time to balance this mother sucker out. Quit letting these people play with you like this. Listen, go back to the bureau. Mm -hmm. The FBI, CIA center, wherever. Maybe I don't know where you all be there doing your business. I just know that you exist, but I don't know what you all be really, really into. Just go back there. Tell them what you found out. He said, these mother suckers are crazy. They don't lost their mother effing minds out here. They're out here trying to take people out. Setting people up. Oh, okay. Just go and tell them the whole speed. And then just wait at the right time when they're taking actions. We'll take out these light workers. <whistles> oh. Please. <laughs> Justice system. I swear. I split my deck and it's the justice that police. <laughs> what? Put your hands up. <laughs> Get up, stand up. It's a stick up, stick up. Put your hands up. It's a stick up, stick up. You touch that person. It's a hit up, hit up. <laughs> okay, I'm telling you, it's a hit up, hit up. Don't do it, Maria. Don't do it, Kevin. Don't do it. It's not worth it, but... If you gotta do all of this to keep a man, to keep a woman, to keep some, it's not worth it. It's always gonna land you in three places poverty, penitentiary, the grave. Look at this right here King of Cups, 
You're about to be real baby in a sticky situation. You're about to be in between a rock and a hard place. And you're a king of cups in the reverse. I'm not talking about the king of cups in the upright. You're a king of cups in the reverse. About to be out here having a hard knock life. A hard knock day. Hard knock week. Hard knock month. A hard knock year. And it's going to be so sudden. You won't even expect. Well, yeah, that, 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 that goes hand in hand. It's going to be so instantaneous, you won't even know what hit you. But it's going to be a long cycle. And you're going to have to bury 10 years, 7 years of karma. Ooh, and listen, when you come out, you're going to be brand stinking new. Self-mastered and everything. That is, if you see things from a higher perspective, and I'm telling you, if you see things from a higher perspective and do their inner work, change your character, stop manipulating, causing blockages for people, and tearing people investments down, trying to get people to sabotage themselves, trying to sneak people, deceive people, cause illusions about people's options and things like that. You'll come out real good. A whole ascendant master. Now listen here. That journey there, it ain't easy. Some days you wake up, you don't even feel like going on no more. You got to find your strength somewhere. Because, baby, it's like somewhere over the rainbow. It's where my strength is, but it's not with me today. But you don't have a choice. You got to keep going until you get to your destination. So just as committed as you, as you all have been in trying to destroy other people, I hope you're there committed when you're going through seven years of karma. Or 10 years of karma. Okay? But anyways, whoever you all have been trying to come after, that beautiful man or woman, they are having their wish fulfillment. And it's going to be an end for someone in a community. They could be like a wealthy man in a community. Baby, you about to be sat down. And I'm not talking about the one in the upright again. There's someone that's been out here pretending to, I don't know what the heck you've been out here doing, pretending. They're trying to put an end to someone receiving some type of either offer, financial payout, some type of assistance. They said, no, don't help him. Don't help. Don't help her. And those words are going to come back to hunt you by the way I keep being told. There's a woman or someone out here that keeps telling either other people or someone, don't help her. You're going to regret it. Don't help her. I don't think you should. You don't know. What you don't know the truth about this person, I'm telling you, you should. It's gonna hunt you because there's a court case that's gonna come up and your words are gonna be used against you. Okay, everybody that you all have been recruiting to work with you, yeah, they're gonna be exposing, they're gonna be going, uh, um, testifying against you all in a court case. It's a man out here, I don't know if this is a king of swords. That man said, I ain't going to jail for you now. I ain't going to jail. Oh, sorry. No, no, no. You're going to jail for what you did because you voluntarily choose to collaborate with these people for what? Finances. You turn your integrity upside down. You said to F with the integrity. They will never know what happened. It's just one star See, We're just taking their abundance. We're just taking their bounty. They don't get to celebrate. And that the Most High was sitting there and listening to you, watching you. All content with the decision that you had made, causing difficulties in people's lives and things like that. And then pretending to be a pillar of the community. And they say, oh, this one is a piece of work. Okay. Okay. We got one for him. We got one for him okay baby that is the source it's a direct statement from the universe it said we are here and we are here to handle business it's a capricorn out here baby you're working real hard to just trap someone to cause a lot of deception just to oh why are you just jealous of someone by the way that's what I want to know. That's what I had wanted to know, Capricorn. Why are you this jealous? What's wrong with you? You want to argue. Don't nobody want to argue with you. Don't nobody want to argue with you. And it's so ridiculous because you are earth sound. You're supposed to earth sign. You're supposed to be grounded. Girl, sir, what are you doing? What are you doing? 
Earth signs are supposed to be what? Grounded, down to earth. You know, mature. You ain't giving none of that. You're just giving toxic, envious, jealous, malicious. Uh, you know what? Uh-huh. Uh-huh. I'm done. I am done. Anyways, thank you all for watching the Ascended Divination Priestess channel. As always, you are so very much appreciated. Keep on liking, sharing, subscribing to the YouTube channel. At some point, I will open the comment section. We also have a lot of karmics in there just thinking that it was just their playground to just play around. No, 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 no. We got work to do over here. Go find you something else to do. Go find something better to do with your time. So I turned it off. I said, I'm sick of these people. You know, you got the real people that want to support and you got the clowns that don't want to grow up. You got people hiring kids. Ain't nobody better go back and forth with a kid in the comment section. So I say, you know what? Let me let me make you guys' job a little bit easier, since they want to hire you to waste your time when you should be at the mall enjoying your day, walking around with your friends, watching your your your, your movies, your shows, you know, doing your hair, you know, having fun. Your parents, your families, your friends, strangers, they got you sitting to stalk people online. Poor little ting tings. Anyways, thank you all for watching. Comics, supporters, everybody. Thank you for watching. Stay blessed. I'll see you in the next read. Goodbye for now.